All right, Chad. Well, it seems like the music has come to an end. Wanted to finish early, so uh, let's just get right into it. I'm ready to rock and roll. Cheers and sociable, everybody. I'm drinking Coke right now. I'm kind of uh, holding off. I have another backup Coke right there, and then I've got a backup Coors Light. I still have a beer. I still have a tall boy left, so I still got some brews, but uh, I figured I would uh, wait on the brews until I need to crack a cold one and toast you all while we're deep into the puzzles of the box's lost fragments. That's the game we're playing. I don't really know how long the game is, but I know that yesterday night we played and uh, we did like two levels, which was two floors of, a, I think, a five-floor tower. We did two floors, so that was a total of eight boxes and two room puzzles. Uh, we finished the Surge 2 this afternoon, and uh, because we finished it a little bit early, I, saw, I thought, well, why don't we do more boxes and get the third floor and um, room puzzle out of the way? So we did four boxes and one room puzzle this afternoon. So as far as I know, we've basically got eight boxes. Same thing tonight that we had yesterday. We've got two rooms, four boxes in each room, and then two room puzzles. And then maybe there's a, like a conclusion. When we get to the end, we maybe we meet the creator of Aurora, is that the name of the robot he's building, and find out what he wants from us, or maybe there's more after that, I don't know, but I think there's at least two more levels with four boxes on each level and the room puzzles to do with the um, uh, parts that we find in each of the box solutions. So we've got a bit to do. So without further ado, let's do it. Boxes, lost fragments, come on in, get your giga brains on. We had a couple of puzzles this afternoon that... Uh, one of them I wasn't a fan of because it, you had to brute force it. It was just, here's six cards. Um, there's four places to put cards. Put cards in the places and press the button, and we'll tell you if it's right or wrong. And you had to keep on, like, just sort of mixing and matching and guessing until you figured out what the four cards were that they wanted. I thought it was going to be a little bit more complicated than that. I thought it was going to be like we would figure out what the four cards were that we wanted based on things we did elsewhere on the boxes, on the box, but it wasn't like that. And then there was another puzzle where we had to turn dials to get these locks to unlock. And if you did it wrong, they reset. So it was along the similar lines of the card thing. You kind of had to brute force it and just kind of work out, well, if I could turn this one, one, and turn that one, two, oh, it reset. Okay, turn this one, one, turn that one, one, still good. Turn this one, three, oh, it reset. Okay, turn this one. I think it was like a brute forcing thing. So I wasn't as much of a fan of the boxes that we did or a box that we did this afternoon as the boxes that we did yesterday night. Hopefully the boxes that we work on, the eight boxes that we work on tonight, um, will be good ones, will be satisfying, and they won't leave us. We always have the ability to, uh, we always have the ability to ask for a hint um, if we need it, right? Uh, we'll try to avoid doing that, but it's there. And I, the, We did ask for a hint this afternoon because we were convinced that there was more than just doing a brute force solution. Turns out we were wrong. There wasn't more than doing a brute force solution. But uh, when we asked for the hint, it didn't actually give us a hint. It just coordinated the box and said, this is the thing that you need to look at, uh, which was the brute forcing thing. So that immediately eliminated this thought that there were other parts of the box that we had to involve or focus on. So let's see how we do. Let's go. You ready? This is like, um, it's not, we, we already did uh, Surge 2 this afternoon, an action game. We've played Lara Croft. Um, Shadows of the Tomb Raider in uh, anticipation of the remasters, which are out and I have downloaded. We're going to start those tomorrow afternoon. So we're going to do Lara Croft uh, Tomb Raider 1 original. We're going to do the whole trilogy, but we'll start with the first one, obviously. We'll start with that tomorrow afternoon. But tonight, depending upon how smart we are, maybe this will be a shorter stream. And if we're stupid, or if I'm stupid, maybe it'll be a longer stream. We've got eight boxes to solve. Let's go. Boxes, Lost Fragments. You. So we are now on the fourth floor doing the level four puzzles. You're playing them right. I've heard good things about the remasters good year. I heard that they did a really nice job on them. I hope uh I hope that's I hope that's the case. Pixel boobs in 2024. Let's go. Hi striker night. How are you, bud? Okay, so here we are. We've just arrived to the fourth floor. And we've got a box awaiting us. Let's go and Take on the challenge. It looks a little bit like the Lincoln Memorial from a distance. Oh, maybe not so much. A little tiny bit. 
Okay, so this is our box. This is the only thing we're concerning ourselves with is this thing right here. It's like a Greek house or something. Let's look at the roof first. What can we do up here? Can we move anything? Does anything move or click or slide? Nothing moves, clicks, or slides. No buttons, no slideies, nothing. Maybe we need a key or something for this. So I can't do anything with the roof. What about the front door? Slide, button push, move. Nothing. Chat, nothing here either. All right, let's try the back. What about the back, chat? We can't zoom in on the back. What about this thing? We can zoom in on this. All right, we just pick it up. Oh, oh, let's look at the top of this. Ah, uh -huh. what's this? I have a key. Can I have the key? There we go. Key found. Look at the key. Can we do anything with the key? Move it, twist it. Nothing. So we have a key. All right, we have a key. There's a keyhole right here. We've got a crossbow. Can we shoot the crossbow? Oh, it looks like it plugs into something. What kind of base does it have? It's like a gear base. Okay. Was there... All right. Okay, can we zoom in on the sides? No. What about the other side? No. So I've got a crossbow with a geared base. I don't think that's going to fit on the roof. I don't think it would fit here, but we'll try it. No, I didn't think so. All right. Now what, chat? What can we do with... We need a geared base for the crossbow. What else can we click on? None of that clicks. So something on the front. It has to be something on the front then. Oh, over here. Ah, huh. so we have to complete the puzzle, the, the look of this. K W D K W D. It's Kez. It says Kez. It's Greek for Kez. Chat. <laughs> Kez, you're in this game, man. Okay, so now we have to put that on here, probably. Do we? K. K. We do W. W. D. Ah, this is what we need for the top. How do we go back in time? I thought we were in an alien future. Oh, uh, I don't know. It's like, I think these boxes, we might, we might be, hmm, we might be in some future. It, like, if you were like to back out of the overall story, uh, each box might be from a different time period kind of thing though. Or it could be like a Leonardo da Vinci type guy who has seen the future or something? I'm not sure. I guess all will be revealed when we get to uh, the top of the tower, once we solve all the puzzles. I'm thinking this goes up here, chat. Now. Open the box. Okay. We have to rearrange this puzzle. Can I move stuff? I can. So he would go here, like that. He would go here, like this. But he doesn't quite. He doesn't quite fit. He doesn't quite fit. But it looks like that, right? They would go there. He would go here. He would 
go here. But it doesn't quite fit. Right? There's pieces that aren't dealt with. He would go there. He fits better there. We're missing... Are we missing pieces? Can't do anything but slide them, right? Can't slide the box. I know what we're supposed to do with this. Like, there's some stuff that... That would fit here as well. Like, that would fit there and that would fit there. But you can't have it in both places. That, that best fits like that. That best fits like that, even though it doesn't quite fit. That could go here, but it could also go here. What are they trying to say with that? Hey, Salem's, I need your giga brain, Salem's. How are you, baby? We've got this green. Okay, maybe it's got something to do with this. These two are like, I don't think it's related, though. Here's our situation, Salem's. This is the, we've got like this thing with slidey pieces, right? I don't think the pieces underneath can, oh, chat, the piece underneath can slide. Okay, I think we solved it. Okay. I didn't realize the piece underneath could slide. Okay. Oh, I think we solved it then. We were lining the pieces up, Salem's, but they didn't line up properly. There were still holes. It didn't make sense. But the... We got it now. The, uh... The base plate underneath could also slide. We didn't realize... Or I didn't realize that. Centrally, Salem's, we have, I believe, eight boxes to solve tonight. This is the first of eight boxes we have to solve. We're not quite sure what is involved. They rotated me to this side, right? So I would assume we're using this. This looks like some kind of a lock. Do I have to get this lined up with that? But I can't turn them without pressing the button. Oh, I can just hold it down. Oh, I see. Like that. Okay. Creating uh, the Colosseum Minotaur. Look at this guy. Look at that guy. Looks cool. Can I get him? Can't do anything with him. He doesn't click or move. He doesn't click or move. They were showing down below here, though, but I can't zoom in on that. I've got this little chariot. Now, this probably sits on this. Okay. I have to shoot the Minotaur chat. We gotta shoot the Minotaur. Is that what we gotta do? But I can't see the Minotaur. So that's, that can't be the only thing. Can I rotate something? Oh, okay. This is kind of tricky. I got, where do I have to hit him, chat? Do I have to hit him in the foot? In the head? Can I shoot high enough? I don't know if I can, okay. Maybe I can rotate it this, that way won't work. Okay, I don't know. Ah! How am I gonna... Okay, I gotta get the shield off of him. We gotta get the shield off of him or something, do we? Or do I have to shoot super early? Shield guys are jerks every time. Maybe we have to shoot really early. So I have to turn it like... It's as far as I can turn it, though. Really late? I'm not sure. Can I move it up and down? Can I move like the... 
How else can I move it? I can't move it any other directions and rotate it. Like that. Where am I supposed to fire it at? It's always going to hit a shield or miss, I think. It's always hitting a shield. What's the green level on the right? Maybe we can change the track or something. Oh, this. This thing? The green level. Oh, the tr oh you're talking the lever, the green lever. This thing? Oh, that's the trigger. Yeah. Yeah. What's this? Maybe we can change the track or something so that we can get a better shot. We can zoom in on this. But nothing here is clickable or pullable or turnable or movable. It seems like I'm always going to hit the... I mean, if I feel like this is right, but I feel like I'm always going to hit the... Shield. It's always going to hit the shield, though. I can't change the angle of this. Maybe there's something else I have to hit. Like, maybe I have to hit the flame pot. Maybe I have to hit the... The flame... Or oh, maybe I have to hit the door or something. Maybe it's not the minotaur at all. Maybe it's the flames. Or something else, not through the door. <laughs> I don't know what I'm supposed to hit. You see, you see something we're supposed to shoot? It's the handle on the top of the box. We already did this, I believe. This is finished. Yeah, I can't even zoom in on that anymore. That was just to unlock something. That was just to unlock something. So I can shoot arrows. Do I? But what do I got to hit? Do I have to hit like this circle, right? Is it like going to be a perfect shot somehow? Or do I hit the... Or do I... I'm thinking maybe I hit the flames. The scrolls up to... They are different. They are different because one has a key. One had a key. We had a key to open this thing here. We found a key and we put it in there. There's a keyhole on that one. This one can't zoom in on. We already did the keyhole thing. Can I change the track or can I pull him out? Or... We got to hit something. I just don't know what it is. And trying to hit the minotaur keeps giving me the... Uh... Got to change this angle. See, it's too high for the... It's too high for the... Uh flame pot that is the most extreme angle I can move it at I could shoot like right away and see if we can get inside the shield no shoot it. I don't know what do you think chat what are we trying to hit here hit the door Just keep trying until do you think we can actually get can you pause your horse? Oh, maybe. Oh, yeah, maybe you're right. Oh, I didn't even think I'd do that. But as soon as I, as soon as I go near, as soon as I go near it to shoot, it's gonna move. It's gonna go right away. I can't move the horse. Like I can stop it here. I don't think that can move anything though. But as soon as I go back to this, it'll move. I can't shoot from here. I don't think. No. But maybe you're right. Maybe we need to stop it, like, really soon. But it's always going to be the shield. Unless it's not... The Minotaur was shooting. Like it's always, it's per, this arc keeps the point of that always on that shield the entire way around. Got to be quick, perfect shot to that circle target. You mean on his chest? Or do you mean here, this thing? Do you mean the circle on the shield? The chest harness thing. 
I can't, I can't hit that though. That, I can't, I, unless, how would I hit it? If I turn, if I turn it this way, maybe I gotta turn it backwards like that and get it all the way around. I, this is looking the wrong way. This will always be looking the wrong way. And if I rotate it this way, don't think it'll ever line up with that. This is the maximum rotation. If I shoot immediately, if I shoot like immediately, it bounces off his body, doesn't it? This is as far this way as I could turn it. And it either goes, it goes off the shield, off the front of the shield. Unless I gotta hit dead center of the shield. It could be dead center of the shield, maybe. So I'd have to shoot a little bit before the apex of the circle, of the arc, but I don't know. I don't know where to shoot this. I can't go anywhere else. I can't hit that chest harness. It doesn't come around the corner soon enough. Is there something else we can hit? Hit the door. What am I shooting at? Hit the door. Hit the door. If I could move this... If I could move the crossbow like if I could angle it up and down but I can't can I change the track somehow what about the stairs oh what's this mechanism part see chat there's more to this what's this thing where would it go it's got like one, two, three, four, five, six. It's got eight. See, there's more to this. We gotta do something with that. Somehow. Do I use it to change the track? Oh. We got a new piece, but where does where do we put it? Is there more in the stairs that we can click on? No, that was the only spot. This was the only spot we could move. Okay, so that's something. What do we do with it? Looks like I can manipulate it somehow, but it doesn't seem to want to move at all. Well, maybe on this side it will. It looks like it plugs into something. Will it go in the horse bit? Try it. Somewhere here. I can't, uh, I can't click on the horse without it zooming right in and start to run. I was thinking maybe we put it on the track or something to stop the, to change the tracks to, so we can shoot a different angle or something, but it doesn't seem to want to go anywhere there. Maybe, we, oh, maybe we use it on here somehow. Aha, you couldn't see the four prongs, the four plugs, because they were, you know, vertical to us. What the heck? Okay. All right, now what, Chad? Press the button. It's not a button. It's a slide. So we have to get this over to the other side, I guess, right? We have to see path. Can we move tiles? We can't move tiles. Tiles change as we move. So that's the wrong way. What's the circular one? We can't go down? Down doesn't help me. Now I can go down. No, I can't.
<laughs> what the heck? Can I move this? No. Does it change? They stay the same when I move around, right? can't go down. Why can't I go down? Because that one doesn't go down. Now it doesn't go up. Can I move? If I could move these. Oh, that's what the circle means. You can move it. Okay, the circle means you can rotate the circle piece. Okay. Not as hard as we thought. long way to go. <laughs> We're almost there, chat. We're almost there. Shoot him in the ass, chat. We can shoot him in the ass. <laughs> You're right, Dr. Claw. You're right. Yeah! It's all about that ass shot. Okay. <laughs> Boom! Or the back. I guess the back. The, the arrow goes high. <laughs> there we go. So there we go, chat. That's our first fragment. First box of the night complete. First box of the night complete. We've got seven more boxes to do. Box number two. kind of wild isn't it a trojan horse yeah it's kind of wild so that's going to be part of the room puzzle once we uh once we get all four pieces there's a, there'll be a puzzle in the room here somewhere over here there'll be a puzzle over here to do with all these pieces we have to collect four pieces first though so let's go get our second piece all right let's look at this little thing on the table first can't do anything there. Can't do anything with this at all. Okay. So let's look at the front of the box. Okay, so this is some kind of a p combination we need to press. Nothing works here. Nothing clicks. So we need, we're need we missing something. Then A piece is missing. We don't have it yet, so we can't do any more here. Hey, meme, what's up, bud? How are you, Ben? Hope you're doing well. Hope Anna's doing well. Hope Clara's doing well. Oh, let's look at the hat. Conductor's hat. Oh, what's this? Metal disc. Can we do anything with it? No. I wonder if the disc goes in that thing. Don't think so, but try it. It does. Okay, so now we've got a disc, so we can select two pieces, but 
obviously we don't know which pieces to select. Oh, I see. We have to match. It's the matching game. Okay. So where's this piece? Right here. So take this one. Take this one. Put this one here. Take this one. Put it here. Take this one. Put it here. Grab this one. Goes there. This one goes here. This one goes here. else is interactive so maybe we need pieces to go in there or something those bars probably lift up we probably have to fit two things in here or something that we don't have yet these windows here you can't zoom in on the sides can't zoom in on the end you're gonna re you're gonna I reckon I'll continue polishing up the car tonight see now if you were in Red Dead Redemption 2 that statement that statement will be like, I reckon I'll continue brushing old dapple tonight. <laughs> nice, sir. Get it all. Spit shine it. Spit shine and wax up that baby. Howdy, partner. <laughs> You're doing a paint correction. What is a paint correction? What does that mean? Easy, girl. You're all right. <laughs> What's a paint correction mean? Do you have to, like, do some, like, is there some scratches and you've got some, like, touch-up paint or something? I need a tool for this, chat. I don't have the tool. What do we got here? Ah, there's our tool. Mechanical wheel. Nice. Buff it up the paint with polisher and polishing compound. Nice. Getting it all smoothed in. Looking good. Ah, there's our first piece. Small badge found. So we got that one takes the bars away. This one probably opens the door. We haven't found that one yet. I don't know where to look though, I'm talking. Oh, there's a card. Let's read the card. The words, the words from the man. As Aurora delved into the vast archives of human history, she observed the human need for higher power throughout history and intrigue began to wonder, could she shape the world as she pleased? So this guy's created a robot and he's found a source of power and given it life, so to speak. So now the AI has become self-aware and it's going to kill everybody. Clean clay bar polish ceramic spray. Clean clay bar polish ceramic spray. This is your car or this is Anna's car or I guess family car. There's the other tool that we need, chat, for this. Yours now, but you did hers before. Is she happy? Did she give lots of appreciation and reciprocation of hugs and kisses? And uh, profuse thanks? No doubt she did. Because you're a good man, meme. She was pretty happy. That's awesome. That's awesome. You can't have the wife looking... Uh, not looking stylish in her ride, in her whip. <laughs> Choo 
Choo! Now what? Let's get this. Let's get this motor humming. Oh my God! Okay. They catch on each other. How are these related to each other? This is gonna be tricky. These two are like stuck, they don't change with each other. So I have to put this one right first because it doesn't change with anything else. Then, oh, it changes? Okay, the first and the third are linked together. Yeah, and this this one links three of them together. Let's put that there. Put this here. Put this here. This is hurting my brain, Chad. This hurts my brain. So they all go with, they all move with each other, right? So. Those two need to be opposite each other. Oh, this hurts my brain. This hurts my brain. <laughs> Back to trade This hurts my brain. I almost can see it, but I can't quite see it. These two here turn together, right? So you kind of want them together. But this one is going to turn the inside one, right? So if I have the inside one lined up with that, and then I turn these two together, now they're not turning together. Oh, it turns with this. So I want to line that up with that. So the last move would be the outside one to turn it here like this. And I want these two lined up with the outside one. So I take this. Put it here, and then this, put it here. So now I have these two lined up with the outside one. So they all will move in unison, and then I, now how do they move in relationship to this one? This only moves the middle one. What moves the inside one? These will move together. These will move together to here. So I need to put this one, how much out of sync? How much out of sync? Opposite, to put this one opposite the mouth like that. And turn this one. Which one is it I wanted to turn? Ah, it's turning that one though. Now I've got three more lined up, but I don't have the. <laughs> I don't have the third one lined up. Oh, God. Hey, Nick, what's up, bud? So if I wanted to move this one, it's going to move the second one. This moves the second one. The first one moves. One moves one and two. One moves one and two. Two moves two and three. Three moves one and three. 
One moves one and two. This moves three pieces. So I line one and two up. One moves one and two. Now, four keeps everything in sync, right? So I have to, now, now as a unit, I have to move all of this, I have to move three. Three is gonna move the middle one. So if I put this in sync, like that, there is, this one moves one and two, right? So one is related to two, one is also related to three. One, the, the first one is related to all three other bands. This one, this one, and this one all move the first one. So which one do I want to use to move it? If I use this one, then I need to move the set then I'll need to move the second band afterwards. These don't move the second band. Doesn't move the second band. This is the only one. This is so number two moves the third band. Only number two moves the third band. have one that moves one and four though do I if I use this one to put it back here oh this is hurts my brain this one will move everything except for the center band so if I put the center band in place this one will move everything except for that band so I can get that in place but I know that to get that in place I have to put it out of place so that I can turn this one to put it in place this one We'll move that one. So if I put this band, if I put one in place of, one in lined up with four, I can get those lined up. Oh my God.
which one moves which? One in the middle is <sighs> I'm almost there. I'm revert the middle one is backwards now. <laughs> Shit. This one moves with this one. So I can My problem is the third one, because if I do this, I can get these two in there and it's the third one is the problem see but the third one is related to the inside one so if I put the inside one to the bottom and then the third one up I can get those two up and then, I, then my problem is the second one Oh my God, now I've got it open on the wrong side. So it looks like I want to put the, the outside ring in the right place and never move the outside ring again. That's what it seems like to me. Get the outside ring in the right place and never move the outside ring again. Keep messing with the other rings and never move the outside ring again. Why can I get it fixed fixed on the outside, not on the inside? It's looking like a pizza slice, yeah. Trying to get all the pieces lined up. I had them all lined up on the bottom. Why would it have to end up being lined up on the bottom? Yeah, I can. Do, I got it all lined up again on the bottom. Jesus, how, how, how can I do it on the bottom, but I can't do it on the top? 
So they're all lined up on the bottom. If I wanted to line them up on the top, it would be the reverse of what I've got. So if I do one half rotation of that one, if I do a half rotation of this one, and I do a half rotation of this one, and I do a half rotation of this one, and then I do a half rotation of this one, they'll all be all lined up on the bottom again. So a half rotation is considered like a full rotation. So if I do a quarter rotation, so if I do a quarter rot, okay, wait a minute. Oh shit, don't screw this up. These two are together. These two are synced with each other. These two, one and three are synced with each other. And one, three, and four are synced with each other. So I can move all three here. If I can get this one, if I can get this one looking the other way, then I could just put one, three, and four up with it. But the problem is I can't get them like that without interfering everything else. Which one is caught like, okay. One is linked to two. Two is linked to three. Three is linked to one. So one is, one is linked to two. Three is linked to one. Four is linked to one. Two is not linked to one. Three and four are linked to one. But nobody's independent. There's not a single independent one. So it's not like you can solve three and then just move the fourth one into place. Because as soon as you move one, you move all of them. And it's a one-to-one -one turn for them. It's a one-to-one -one turn for them. It's a one-to-one -one turn for all them. Move the outside one to the top. Three is linked to one, so we can we can solve it. Except one's going to be up is going to be reverse of what we need. Now I could move one and two down to the bottom, and I could get one right by moving three, but that means that two will be wrong. I could reverse that so that those two are right. There might be a single move here now. Three is wrong. One is linked to two. So if I could get three and four correct and one and two incorrect, I could move one and two into, I could move these two independently. They're kind of like one unit independent unit. So if I get three and four right without then I could move them independent. Now they're right. Now these two move them independently. I was looking for the independent two. That's what the, it was. It wasn't one piece that was independent. It was two pieces that were moving as one unit that were became the independent piece. That's what I was looking for. Was that I was looking for the independent move. Once I saw it, I had it. Okay, go. Let's go. Oh, you had to have, well, there had to be, to, to solve it, you had to have two pieces acting as one. I was thinking it was just one piece sliding in at the end, but you had to have two acting as one piece. That was brain, that was brain hurting, yeah. It was brain hurting. Okay, let's go. What do we got now? All right, we can move that. We can move a piece around, so, so what? 
What are we trying? I don't know what I'm trying to do. I guess I'm trying to get these two things on there, right? We can put it in the middle. And then move it down. Doesn't go down. Maybe I have to get them both across before I do it. That's not it. Oh, we're trading places. I'm putting the putting those two over there and the other two over here. Okay, we're trading places. Okay. Okay. You gotta trade places. But that piece is upside down. So I gotta get this piece out of here. Bring this back. Oh no 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 shit. Bring this back. Put this piece in, right? Bring this all the way to the bottom. Get this piece out of here temporarily. Get this piece out of here. Put that up there. This piece in here. Let's go. Whew. Okay. All right, chat. We did it. That was a wacky. Yeah! That was a wacky box. Yeah! Oh, GGs. We got six more boxes, chat. Two more for this floor. It's 2 a.m. It's giving you a braiding. Look, I got a beer. I haven't cracked it yet because I only have one left. But I'm savoring it. I'm savoring it for uh, for the final floor. Or if I get super stressed out on a puzzle. All right, we got two pieces. We need two more pieces, two more boxes for this floor. All right, erase your brains, erase your brains. New, new puzzle, new ideas. Looks like uh, we're going to the uh, Arabian desert now. What's this? A knife. That's not a knife. Erased. That's not a knife. That's a key. A key, chat. We have a key. Okay. Now what? Do we have a keyhole anywhere? Let's look. Uh, what's this? Not the right kind of. Not the right kind of hole. Oh, padlock. Padlock, chat. We have a lit candle. Any secrets on the candle? Nope, just a candle. Okay. We have a lit candle. Doesn't look like we can use the lit candle yet, so we're going somewhere else. What about this genie lamp? Okay. Can't interact with it. It's, the lamp is the lamp. Okay. So we've got a light and a lamp. Light the lamp? How though? I, it, we picked it up. I don't. I don't think. I, I don't think I can combine items. Maybe once we set it down somewhere. Maybe. Um, I saw some tabs on this here. What's this? What the hell, Chad? What do you think on this? What are we trying to do? Let me just push a button and see what happens. Okay, so we're trying to get... These matching with these. So that matches with that, that matches with that. And the insides have to match as well, do they? Like that. So that matches with that, that matches with that, that matches with nothing. Oh, that matches with each other. They match. I don't know if that's I don't know if that's what we're trying to do. Um 
Match, match. Match, match, match. 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 So now we got to get these middle ones to match. Put all the same ones in a row. Oh, that's an idea. Yeah. Good idea, Salem's. I like that. Okay, let's do that. That could very well be what we... Yeah, you're right. So, like, all stars, all bolts, all... Yeah, that's probably right. That's probably right. I like that idea. Like that. She is so smart. She is so smart. We win the jackpot. You're rich, Salem's. Oh my God, Salem's, you get all the monies. Oh, and a scorpion. <laughs> now what? Scorpion figure. Can we do anything? Okay, it's got a. Oh, we saw that somewhere. We saw that. This is this is like a handle for unlocking something, right? Where did we see that up here? Spin it. Okay. Metal ring. Okay, a metal ring with little notches on it. Okay. Something to do with this? Yeah, because there's notches on this. Oh, is this like a slidey puzzle? I don't think we have anything for that yet. Does this have anything on the bottom of it? It's flat on the bottom. So it's not like a socketed thing. What else have we got here? Can't move anything here. Nothing moves. Can't, I'm trying to click on the front of this, but it, hmm. it doesn't. Oh, 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 oh. There's some stuff hidden in the. Does this have a socket on the bottom? It does. Okay, that's what it is. Now maybe we combine. There might be a combining now, Salem. Is there something here too? Nothing in this pile. Now maybe we combine. It looks like. It looks like this is going to go on here. Oh no, maybe not. And the lamp. And the candle. And Macatootie. What the heck? Oh, oh no, what happened? Failed the, po oh, the teeth are closing. So we've got to do what? What are we supposed to do? Two, three. 
Okay, four is too much. Oh, it's like red light, green light? It's red light, green light. Yeah, only move on blue, 100% Salem's. boxes down three boxes down model tower five boxes to go we need one more box for this floor erase your brains erase your brains erase your brains Look at it first. Looks like a like a um, MIT. Okay, let, they put us on this side. So let's look at this thing. Looks like something plugs into that. I can't interact with anything here. Doesn't move. There's something here. Can I interact with the table? No. What about here? Can't interact with any of that. Here, nothing. Card. As time passed, Aurora developed a talent for predicting the future. Her extensive writings often contain nothing more than allusions to the future events to which they would relate, and texts that contain actual narratives tell only portions of a larger story. Everything seemed beyond human comprehension, as if it was encrypted in only a way she could understand. She's already starting to change the world, chat, so that the humans don't know what she's saying. <laughs> What's this thing? No worries, Salems. Okay, looks like this is what we gotta do. So this can go in a bunch of places. I need two that are pointing upward. These two. It could be these two, or no, those are too narrow, so it has to be these two. A wheel. Okay. Is that what goes here? It doesn't look like that would fit here. What about the roof? Can't click on the roof. So it must be here. It is here. So now this pushes the pins in. Okay. One, two, three. I need to get these blue lines in line with this. Is that what it is? So, what am I to understand? Is that, a, is that like a break? Two. So, okay. One. Can I move these independently? I can't. This moves three, this moves three, because I have three selected. Now, so this moves one, this moves two, this moves three. One, one, two, one, two, three. So those will end up being in line with each other. If I press this, does it put a break on it or something? Oh, you can move these. Oh, okay. So I need to move this two. I need to move this one. This has to move one. This has to move two. That one's, that one's going to be a problem. Okay. So they're in line with each other. How many spokes are there? So that would go one, two, three, four. So I could do two twice. Oh. 
one, two. So I need to move this two. If I move this three, that's only going to move one. Okay. So now to get this in line, it would have to move one, two, three. This one would have to move one. This one's already in line. Shit. So now I'm going to get two in line again. <laughs> this one's going to move two. Those will eventually go back in line if I just keep pressing, though, won't it? But I... Hmm. What's the... How are they related to each other? These are 90 degrees. These are in sync, and these are 90 degrees off. Moving this two will put this back in line. Okay. That's two away. That's three away. That's one away. There it is. So one away, three away, two away. Oh, no. Another one? No, come on. <laughs> I was goddamn brilliant there, chat. Now I've got to be brilliant again. That's two. That's three. That's three. So I need to do this I think okay now this one's got to get out of place this is one this is one so put this here that's two that's three that's so these two can't be the same so if I go one two three it'll be bad so two again here one would put this two away Two will put this one away. One will put this two away. Three will keep it. One, two, three, put it three away. So do that again. And then put the one here, put the two there, and the three there. Let's go. Seems like they're focusing on this area. Can't move anything here, though. Nothing moves. Not that area. What about this? Don't have anything to put in there yet. Top towers. Ornamental piece, ornament piece. Okay. This tower has no interactives. This tower is sticking up. Rotating handle. Do we have a spot to... What's this? Aha, there's the piece. Got it. Now, do we have a spot for a crank handle? Top. Fabulous Fabergé egg, chat. Can I fit these two pieces together? They don't fit together. Let's look at the egg. Can we peel the egg open? No. I don't know. Maybe they do fit in here? No. I didn't think they did. Let me look at them again. Can we do anything with them? Like twist them, rotate them? Move them around. 
spin them because it could be like a double layer piece that turns into a full piece when we spin it no it doesn't seem to be they both have a, like a prong thing that looks like it needs to stick into something I don't know if we can do anything with this egg yet. Oh wait, what's that on the side? There's a thing here, look. Right here. A gong mallet? Not a gong mallet, a gong mallet? What the hell? What the hell? What am I gonna do with that? I don't have a gong. Gong, the last thing I was expecting to get was a gong mallet. Oh, they fit in here. Oh, those are holes, not, not, um, those are holes. Cla we gotta get a gong, chat. We're getting a gong. Bang a gong. Hey, I want my gong. Where's my gong? Okay, so we can move these things. Question is, we can't move these ones. Oh, yes, we can. So we're trying to get them all to match. Is that what we're trying to do? Or we're trying to get all one, maybe the banner? Is the banner, there, yeah, the banner. Where's the banner on that one? There's the banner on that one. This is like that circle puzzle. <laughs> that top one have this banner there it is all right something opened up somewhere else dragon medallion okay that goes here where's my gong there's my gong chat there's my gong. This is for you, chat. <laughs> what kind of gong is that? That's not the gong I was expecting. <laughs> we did it. Let's go. All right, now we can solve the room. Now we can solve the room. We've got a dragon, a tower, a Trojan horse, and some kind of a weird key stamp looking thing, right? Whatever that is, a model figure. Can't interact with it, can I? Can I mess with it here? No, looks like it plugs into something though, right? That's like a tower or a chimney or something or something. All right, let's go to our table and solve the puzzle of the room. Okay. So, what do you think goes there? This? No. This? No. This. None of the above, Chad. None of the above. So, not yet. What about here? Looks like uh, it's got a square base. I don't think we have anything with a square base. Maybe the Trojan horse starts over here. And they're going to bring it over on the boat, right? No? Maybe I have to get the boat. Oh. Okay, we got to put the boat back there. Now we put the Trojan horse in on the... Got it. Now we bring the Trojan horse across. We do it. Oh, move it over. Now we bring it across. Bring the Trojan horse in. The castle walls. Now what? We can't move the Trojan horse without a thing. Oh, that's this. What this is? is a bridge. Got it. Now what? Now this is too high. Gotta lift it up. 
Drop it down. What's the base of this dragon look like? It's a big circle. Go here? No. What's the base of this look like? It's like a little circle. I would have thought, oh, maybe there's a, t is there a turret missing on our tower? Can't turn it that way though. Can't look at it that way. Go here? No. Maybe we don't move this over yet. Maybe we bring the Trojan horse back a minute. Can't. We're not allowed. Only if I only bring it over is all I can do. Oh, maybe I just wasn't zoomed in. Maybe that's what the problem was. I just wasn't zoomed in. Okay. So, I have to press the buttons corresponding to the thing on the, so, all of them, oh, I don't want that connected, I have to do it all in one go? How can I draw it all in one go, though? Wait, that's what I got to do. I got to draw this pad. So I got to, I got to start. Okay, I got to start at one side and go all the way around. Um, middle one is not part of it, so I got to start. Okay, okay. can't get the horse in there yet so I have to this is like a weight that's gonna lift this up is it so the question is where does it sit there's a tower there but there's not a tower here here somewhere here chat something we, we gotta do so oh this does this turn Ah. Yeah, you were right. It was it was a, it was a zoom in. You were right, Sam. Now we're gonna lift him up, right? Okay. Fire him in. <laughs> now we get the pass to the next floor. A little face mask thing. Yep. All right. We've got four more boxes, chat. We can take this pass to the elevator mechanism. And we're going to go to the fifth floor. It is pretty. Yeah, it's cool. It's, it's cool, Sams. It's pretty. All right. Erase your brains. Erase your brains. Oh, my God. Okay, yeah, oh, it's all right. Okay, raise your brains. Here we go. Box number one of four. It's like a Viking's treasure chest or something. Is your brain erased, Dr. Claw? <laughs> the Claw! All right, let's go. What's this thing? We, let's start with this horn of plenty. Handle. Okay. Let's look at this side of the box. We can do that, but we can do no more. Okay. Can't do anything else here. It does nothing. 
That does nothing yet. Don't know what that's for. Probably something inside that we can't see yet. Does the handle go here? So this is like uh, Resi 2. It's a slide puzzle. I don't have any side to side, directly side to side pieces, so there's no straight over, right? It's up and down and angles. It's all up, down, and angles. I, have, I, I actually have two up, straight up and downs, which makes me think that this is probably wrong, that it probably has to go down. Maybe not. Maybe I. Mm, how am I going to get that piece over there? I think I need this piece here, right? But there's no side to side, so it has to go. So now it has to go. I think it has to go like this. Because there's no side to side pieces other than like the 90 degree angle pieces. And you notice that's broken in between. Is that like a break? I don't know if they, that will connect. It might, probably will. Probably will. There's no side to side pieces. So I'm thinking it's going to have to be this piece here. Then it's probably that piece, that piece, that piece, and that piece. Yeah, I was right. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go! All right, what we got? What we got? What we got? Anything interact? Oh, oh. Oh, we saw that symbol. We saw that symbol, the Celtic knot, over here. What does that do for us? Ah! Got a short sword. Can I mess with it? Can't really mess with it. Nothing I can do with it. So there's in the top of the box. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> this is getting scary. What, what is. <laughs> okay. What does this do now? I move these independently? No. What's this do? So I'm trying to move the handle up. That's all? That's all? That's not so bad. That's not so bad. Do the same on the other side.
Okay, we've got four rune coins. And we've got these little dudes here, right? With the rune symbols on them. Do they put a coin in their hat? Get the ancient Viking power, chat! Let's go! We gotta put something here. That's a pretty good power up. We gotta put something here. Nothing, nothing there moves. But it's focusing on that as if we're supposed to do something with it, right? So can I rotate this gold part? No. Lift it? No. Pull it? Push it? No. Turn it? Nothing. Nothing. Can't lift it, can't push it, can't pull it, can't turn it. Looks like I gotta sit something on it, but I don't have anything at the moment. What else was uncovered by these runes? Oh, what's this? There we go. The dragon token was uncovered. That's what goes here. Now we turn it. What the hell? There's your alien stuff, Dr. Claw. Box one, three boxes to go. Who knew the Vikings were aliens? <laughs> Except Assassin Creed players. Okay, that's some weird looking thing. That's gonna be interesting in the in the puzzle room. That looks like some kind of weird combination lock. The Cryptex. Puzzle number two. Once we beat box number two, I'm cracking my beer chat. Once we beat box number two, it's time to crack the beer. Okay, what's this, Polynesian? <laughs> Look at his teeth, okay. Oh, give him a headdress. Don't know what I do with that yet. Can I press his cheeks? Pull, press, pull, nothing. Teeth, nothing. I could turn his headdress, but I don't know what the significance of that is yet. Probably have to find something to put on that, or can't take that, right? Press the buttons, no, nothing on that side. Is there anything on the flat? Eh, there's, what's this? Let's look at the cup first. It's Makatuti's coffee cup. As her ideas became more dangerous, I decided to use whatever trust she had left in me to detach her dark energy heart under the false pretext. See, now he's, now he's lying to his own creation because he's afraid of it, that it needed adjusting. Surprisingly, she believed me. I didn't waste a second ripping her heart out as soon as I found a firm grasp on it. I stood before the lifeless creation feeling a profound sense of loss and regret. I had created something remarkable only to imprison it forever, denying its curiosity potential for the sake of safeguarding humanity see he was flirting see this is the kind of shit chat this is the kind of shit that bacon fixation is messing with with his ai bot in chat bacon's helper i've warned him i've warned him i've told him be careful about bacon's helper it's gonna want to take over the world <laughs> that's one ugly dude <laughs> look at that guy oh looky 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 here an old arrowhead. 
Justice for bacon. <laughs> He said, be careful if Bacon's helper becomes self-aware. It's going to start banning people and and bringing and, and gifting subs to other bots. And the next thing you know, next thing you know, Bacon's helper is going to be running the show. And we're all going to be subservient. <laughs> What's this? Okay, we, go, we got one, two, three dials. Line up the dot, line up the circles. I don't think that's right. I don't think that's right. Something probably else we have to do. I think, we're, I, I don't know. I think we might be missing something for this puzzle. There's like, probably have to get them in this, in where the gold snakes things are. Put them in the gold snake area. But we're missing probably something here, right? To finish this puzzle. That's my guess. I don't know though. Oh, 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 you can move them. Okay, so what are we trying to, what's our, what are we trying to achieve then? We trying to fill the entire thing with gold, with blue dot, with blue stuff. That one's full now, but so what? What the good does that do us? That we've got them all in there. This one's not in there, but. I've got one, two, three, four, five. But I've got a one, two, three, four. So I've got to get them one, two, three, four, five in here, or I don't know what they want me to do. How? How? I don't want to start trying to figure out the puzzle until I. Oh, maybe I got to get them all. I got to get them all in the center gold disc. Yeah, get them all in the middle. I think you're right, Salem. I think you're right. Well, that shouldn't be that hard to do, should it? Oh, they stop it from slide. Oh, because it's at its maximum extension. I see. I see. I'd have to work from the inside out or something. gonna be getting the last one and it's gonna be the hardest part isn't it um i should have put that one on the far out wheel not I, I got these two on the same wheel that should i shouldn't have done that
I need to finish it by doing two at the same time, right? Do I pull these two in at the end? So I need this one to be here. So that when I pull these two in, this one, this will go boom, boom, two. This will go boom, boom, two. And this one being here will go boom, boom, there, right? So I need this one to be here. Okay. get it to move over one without disturbing the others that's I'll get I gotta get this one here <laughs> right essentially if I take that one right outside the wheel that one in line, then bring it back in, I've got those two here and here, that's it, right? Ah, I can't pull it all the way in though, so I, okay, that was the right idea, but I had the thing too far off. I need to make a little bit more room. Put it here, like that. Now it'll work. Let's go. That was kind of a cool little puzzle. I think I made it harder than it was, but I think Salem's would have solved that way faster. <laughs> okay. So we've got a skull. We've got an arrowhead. What's on the other side? Oh, what's this? Can I stop this one from moving by sliding? Hmm. Crystal skull. Oh, we got a dragon face. Small figurine. With a circle on it. Chinese checkers puzzle. It's a sliding puzzle with a... It's a slide puzzle in the shape of a diamond, and the pieces, instead of being fully lined up with each other, are, like, off-center from each other, is it? God. But there's, like, repeating. There's, like, two dudes looking at... Hmm. How fun, yeah. But I don't know if that's what we're doing here. Because it doesn't look like doesn't look like the pieces, the buttons are related to the background. Do I I'm not sure if I can see like is that a person? That's their head here. That's this one, right? That's this one, maybe. Yeah, that's must be this one, right? So that's that dude, right? But this looks almost like it's correct. But there must be another one that's like this. Because it has to match up with this stuff. Is 
Is it this one? No. These two are, these. it's like a symmetrical thing, right? These two, that's all symmetrical and the same. So these two would be the same. So that means if this is a person, symmetrical, this guy's gonna go over here then, is it? Like that, that doesn't look like it lines up though. Those. That doesn't look like it's symmetrical. Uh, have I found a fit for the arrowhead yet? Not yet, unless it's somewhere outside of this. Not yet. I can't see anywhere the arrowhead's gonna go yet. What's this slot at the top? We can't go up there yet. I think, I think we're on the, oh, what's this? No, we took something from here. I think we're, I think we're on the right puzzle. I think we have to do this to open something else up. Is this, see this thing here in the middle? It looks very similar to this guy this guy here, not quite the same. He's got like this fancy headdress thing. So I'm assuming that this guy probably has some kind of a headdress thing. This piece, maybe up top. Like that, that's probably correct, right? Top one is the left of his face. This one goes to the left, over here. Like that. think I'm willing to give it a shot so this this is the symmetrical version on this side because it looks like it's gonna go like symmetrical I think I could be wrong they don't quite like this looks like this one should be like a tail of something here, right? Like part of that design. Like there's a dragon thing here and a dragon looking thing here. That doesn't look right. That doesn't, does that look right? I don't know if that looks right. No, cause then this piece, does, does that look, I don't know if that looks, no. Cause the side, does the side of his face look right there? I don't know if that's right or not. That doesn't seem right. Let's try all different pieces here. Does that look right? That doesn't look right. This I think is right. I think that, cause see the way that that top of his head kind of does that, that looks right, right? This part here and the bottom part of the circle there and the bottom part of the circle there, that I think is right. This fancy headdress piece, it, th there must be some like pieces coming off that we're looking for. The hardest part about this is uh, keeping the, seeing the, <laughs> when you move pieces, you forget how they were, how they looked. Like that kind of looks right. Maybe it's gonna like turn a little bit and drop in or something when it, when the puzzle's done. This doesn't look right. This looks way off, right? That looks, that looks dumb, doesn't it? That headdress, that doesn't look right there. That might, uh, that looks dumb too, doesn't it? That looks dumb too. Does that look right? I, I can't tell by the art if it's right or not. I don't know if that looks right or not. That looks a little weird to me too. It's a hard art style to match up. I don't know, is that? That can't be right either, is it? This is like the top of a dude saying hello or something. Where's so you, there would be a body underneath or something, wouldn't there? Can you rotate the piece at all? Pieces? Can you rotate them? Just you can only slide them. You can only slide. Oh, there! Look here. Here's a body. That's a bottom of somebody's body. There's two legs and an arm. There you go. That looks like it could be right. That's because this, the bottom of the chin, the 
bottom of the chin and the head, and he's kind of got his legs are split apart, and he's got one arm up, and he's got one arm down. That looks like it could be right. So I think these two are right now. Even though it seems a little off, it, I think that's right. The tongue matches up, right? So now, if those are correct... Ah, look, 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 that matches. Look, see the, see the curve of the cheeks? That matches. So this one must be his other cheek, right? There, so that's the top of his head, that's the side of his face, that's the side of his face. That's the bottom of his face. So these four are correct. Now we just have all the rest, chat. Now we just have all the rest. I think this one's probably right, but I could be wrong about that. This one could go here, maybe. Getting these to slide into the correct spots is gonna be hard. Is that right? I don't know if that's right. See how, okay. See how the top of this and the top of that look the same and the bottom of this and the bottom of that look the same, which makes me think that the thing in the middle would have to be the same on both sides. But we, do we have two that look the same? We have these two that look very similar. We've got the two dudes. So you can put one. Oh. That's right. There. Now this dude's going to go here, right? That's right. So the two dudes are right. The cheekbone has to go back. How am I going to get that back in place? Okay, so this is right, this is right, this is right. The cheekbones are right. This is hard. Okay, so... We know that this has got to get changed up. Because that guy goes there, right? So that's right, that's right, that's right, that's right, that's right, that's right. So it's the V ones here, these V ones that are wrong. The bottom one would have a continuation of this pattern, wouldn't it? Maybe this one? going the wrong way. I'm going the wrong way. I don't know if that works. Does that bottom one look right? I don't know if that looks right. Cheekbone got put out of place. It's hard to get them in the right spot. Oh, this is hard. That's right, that's right, that's right. That's right, that's right, that's right. We still have the V wrong. Could the, could the, could the, this is pro, you know what? This is probably up at the top. Because it's a point. And this is probably part of this here, a point. This is probably the one that goes down to the bottom. Because it's a bottom piece, straight down. So this probably goes up there. This probably goes down here. There's the top of a bird here. And there's his body. There's the body of the bird that connects onto that. Now the problem is how do I get it there without messing everything else up and losing perspective? There's the bird, see? Okay, so there's the, the guy, the headdress, the guy, 
the cheek, the cheek, the guy, the bird, the bottom, which I don't know if that is. I, look, I think that might be right for the bottom. This bird, there's the head of the bird looking the other way. It's like a parrot bird or something, right? No, this has to go up the top. This is the bottom piece. That goes down to the bottom, I think. He goes there. We're going to try to get this up to the top. Get the guy there, the headdress there. Cheek in there, the bird in there. So that's right, 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 that's right. This piece has to get over here. So we just got one more piece to do. Oh, no, 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 no. The bottom is probably the open. The bottom is probably the hole. This piece goes over here. Is this game just on PC? I'm not sure, Salem's. I'm not sure. This piece goes over here. This piece goes on the side. That's the side piece. That's the cheek goes back. That's the guy at the top. So all that's wrong now is this piece has to go over here, right? Well, the bird, uh, the bird goes here. He goes there. Here we go, chat. Here we go. And this goes here. No? We're close, chat. We're close. Oh, 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 this is wrong here. This is wrong. Maybe I get the birds backwards. That has to be right. See the tip, the point? That has to be right. These guys waving to each other is right. The headdress has to be right. The cheeks we know are right. This matches everything up. This bird definitely matches. This guy matches. So it has to be these two have to be reversed. Is it just these two get reversed? Easier said than done getting that last piece reversed. <laughs> it's going to be hard to get that last piece reversed. Yeah, the birds, these two have to flip, right? These two got to get reversed. How do I get it? Yeah. So that goes there. That looks right. Bird goes there. That looks right. So now I got to get this up here and this up here somehow. Get them in the right order of cycling. That's it. That's it. Let's go! That was hard, not just because it was a diamond slider, but because it was hard to tell if the art matched up or not. That was made, what made that hard for me. Yeah! <laughs> Let me see, Salem's, if uh, boxes lost fragments. If I go to the wiki, it'll list all platforms. Does it have its own wiki? Wikipedia? It doesn't have its own Wikipedia. Pro game guide, I don't want that. Boxes lost fragments, full game walkthrough, I don't want that. It doesn't have a wiki? Um, I just, okay, boxes, lost fragments, Sony. Boxes, lost fragments on console. Everything we know about boxes, lost fragments. What is it? Story, gameplay, development, trailer, release date. Oh, platforms and editions. Launch will receive on standard edition. You can go blah, 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 get a box, the full package. You can download the game. Big Loop Studios. Where's the platform? Okay, there you go. Boxes Lost Fragments is currently slated 
uh, to launch Android and PC via Steam, as well as Xbox Series XX, PlayStation 5, or Nintendo Switch. So it's on everything. It's on everything. It's on everything, Salem's. Okay, what do we got? Aztec artifacts. Is that what goes on his headdress? I think it I think it is. Yeah, do it up, Salem's play it on the switch, yeah. Knock it out of the park. Gonna line up his bloodshot eyes. Gonna Ooh. Is this where we put the arrowhead, I think? No? What the hell? A skull? There's the skull, goes in there. I guess I guess you'd put a skull in a skull. It makes sense. It makes sense. So we gotta connect the dragons. But it's not a slidey though. Oh it's a twit oh it's a tumble. It's a tumbler. That's not that hard then, is it? There's maybe more than one way to can go though. I I'm assuming I have to use the edges, so I do the edges and then the middle determines itself, right? Or maybe not. Maybe there's more than one connector here, okay. Now the arrowhead fits in here. Stab him in the chin. We got it, baby. We got it. We can uh, go to the next room. Fragment collected. An ancient key. Let's go. It's beer o'clock, chat. It's beer o'clock. It's beer o'clock. Oh, yeah, it's beer o'clock. <laughs> Time for puzzles three and four. Erase your brains. Erase your brains. Erase your brains. We're doing a pyramid. Cheers, guys. Cheers. Sociable. Oh, yeah. All right, let's do this. We shot a man in the jaw for almost no reason. It's beer o'clock. No, it's 3.15 a.m. Listen, Salem's. It's beer o'clock, okay? Somewhere it's beer o'clock. So we're, I'm having beer with all of those where it's actually beer o'clock. Ah. Watch out. I'm having beer now. So this puzzle, we're going to knock this right out of the park, chat. Like, no problem. Okay, an Egyptian theme. Can't click or move anything there. What about this? Can't click or move anything there. Interesting. We've got the eye of us. What is that's who's that? That's the eye of Horus or the eye of what are we supposed to do with it? Turn it right side up. Put it into the circle. Where did it go? How did it end up upside down? Oh, I have, probably have to line it up with... Ah, there you go. I had to line it up with this. the goal but 
why. I don't want to do this until I figure out why. What am I trying to do? What's the purpose? Is there, is there somewhere there a pattern that I need to see to do this? Let's look at something else first. Got a hammer. We got some clay pots, chat. No? Smash! 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 Ah! Puzzle piece. Okay. with the kitty cat can't do anything with the kitty cat where does the puzzle piece go over here okay now my goal is what to get this piece in here probably right my goal is to get this in here probably Four on one side, four on the other, and the two spots separating. Okay, Sam's, we'll do it. We'll do it. Let me look at this, and we'll go back. This looks like a grenade. A scarab beetle. Does he open up? No, he goes on something. All right, let's have a look. Let's have a look at that. So put the dots at the top and the bottom, and then the eyes on one side, the beetle on the other. Okay. How do I, um, I can't move any of the pieces though. So I don't know if I can, it doesn't let me slide them around. You know what I mean? Like I can only put them on this or take them off of this. That's all I can do. I can't like sh shimmy them. And this only has one side. It doesn't have two sides. So I really can't do anything with this yet. I don't think. Does this move? No. I think, see these, do you see these notches here, here, here? And I think maybe something has to go here. Do, I to do this? Does this have notches? No, it has a dot on it. I can't move this thing around. Let's see what else we got. Can't move this. There's no place for the scare. What am I looking for? I'm looking for some kind of little button or thing to put on. Lock that, push that on. Is there a little something we haven't seen? What's on the very tip? Can't go to the very tip of the pyramid. It's probably this, but I don't know what I'm supposed to do with it. What's that? This? Nothing clicks or moves or slides. Oh, now, now I clicked on that about 16 times. Suddenly it comes to my hand. Okay, 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 okay. So, all right. So I've got a medallion. Does that go on here? Probably, right? There's our little dot for our scarab. all of this. Oh, here we go. What's this?
can't rotate or move it. I can only I can only push the button, but it doesn't do anything. I don't have any other objects. Can I rotate the outside ring? No. Can't rotate at any of these rings. Oh, I hold it. Oh. Hold it down. Stop it at something. So I gotta do them in a certain order. Or just do them, I don't know. Or just do it like that. <laughs> okay, what do I got? I got a crystal. Where's the crystal? The crystal's got a little sharp point in it. We got a crystal on there. Oh, on the top, this is, the, is this the top of the pyramid? No, probably not. crystal there's light replace this crystal or is there a crystal like is there a reciprocal on the other side there isn't is there no you can't look at that other crystal this is not going to go here that doesn't make any sense um where are we going to put this crystal That's the most obvious position I would have thought, but nothing, it doesn't go there. What's this? Ah! We've got the, uh, we've got the lead, the, the, the guide for this, but how do I manipulate this? My, my problem is how do I manipulate this? So it's not quite what you said, Salem's, but it's that idea. Have a good sleep, Dr. Claw. But how do I manipulate? Like, I can move a piece out of place, but none of, nothing else moves. So how? If, so what if I do that? So what if I do that? Then what? I, okay, so let's say I want to put it down here. How, though? How, though? None of these move. Can't click on them, slide them, twist them, turn them. Nothing. So, we gotta do something else first. Something with this crystal, I'm thinking. I don't think I can put it here. No. Do I do something else with this? Maybe I do this again somehow. No, nope, this is no longer interactable. Do I do something with the kitty cat? I'm still allowed to look at the cat. Why would I still be allowed to look at the cat? Sometimes like, <clears throat> sometimes you're allowed to look at something again, even though you aren't going to use it and other times they once you've used it you can't look at it anymore so that's kind of throws me out nothing there can we move any of this stuff there's something here a button here I don't know See this pillar here, I can't I can't zoom in on that. But this one over here. I can zoom in. Oh, that's just to see this side piece probably. But we did that. And I can zoom in on this, but I can't do anything with it. We already broke all of this. What am I not seeing about this puzzle? Like, I think, I think we got the legend for it, right? The problem that I have is I don't see how I'm supposed to organize. These don't move. 
Am I, am I not pulling or pushing in the right way? This is the only thing that rotates. This is the only thing that moves. If I get a piece out of place, none of these other pieces move. They don't, you can't move anything. So how does that help me? Oh, it moves. Oh, okay. I didn't know that. So it, it basically, it just shoves them when you move it. So it is this puzzle. So if you put it here, it just shoves everything out of the way. So what do I got to do? Dot, crab, I, I, crab. Dot, crab, I, I, crab. Dot, crab, I. I. Dot, crab, I, I. I need a crab. Crab. Dot, crab, I, I, crab. Dot, crab, I. So switch these two around. Put this here. Okay. See, I didn't get that. I didn't get. I didn't get that. You click on it again. I was trying to slide because you slide it in, and then you click on it, and it fires out and shoves them apart. That's kind of a weird mechanic, but okay, I got it. Let's go. Progress. Strange pyramid. Does it open up at all? No. This has got to be the top of our pyramid, right? So we put this up top. Now the scarab goes all the way up. And we put the crystal in here. We got one more room to do. DNA container. Race your brains. Race your brains. I'm filling up, filling up my brew. All right, let's go. Fourth room on the fifth floor. Now we're going to the Far East, it seems. Ninja throwing star? Okay, can't do anything else there. That's it. That's all they'll let me do. No. Okay, I don't have a reference for this. What am I trying to do? Mm. I guess I need some four dice combination, but I I don't have a reference for that yet. Can't do anything there yet. Can't do anything there yet. <laughs> What's my goal here? Trying to match picture? Oh, 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 what's there? There's a three. Do I 
have to put this in the corner. Is that like a corner of the frame? A four. So the four, the th so three, four, three, f three, four, five, two. Three. Oh, it's going to be tricky. Five. Damn it, I'm smart, chat. Got a brain like a freaking bear trap, chat. Okay. Now what we got here? Is that the piece I need for this? I don't think so. That looks like a, that looks different. Done this. That goes here. The Great Pizza Puzzle. So it moves it two at a time? Or does it move it, th moves it three at a time? So this is every other one. This is every third one. So this one. And this one. Now I'm going to have a problem, though, because it's not other or third. Still not other or third. Got to make other equal to third. It's going to turn that one. every other one and every third one, right? So if I do this, it's going to flip that over. Now, I, now it's good. Let's go! Okay. This is the thing that I need for this, I think. Is it? No. look at this again. Is it a puzzle in itself? It is. If I have to do it while I'm Got to be related to this. Something must come out of this. This has to open up when I do it right. Isn't that right, though? Okay, you have, I had to keep on rotating it. Okay. So now I got to do the order right. Okay, so this one? No. This one? No, that one. So one, two, three, four, four, six, four, one, four, two, four, three, four, three, one, two, four, three, one, two, six. No, so it's four, three, one, two, 
five, six. Okay. Oh, a box inside a box? I'm a smart ass Salem sometimes. So you can travel back and forth on the portal. So we so I'm here and I'm not I don't want to travel back yet. I'm at the Tory gates. So got a keyhole. Now that's the original box. It's it it went down into the thing, right? So I've got a keyhole. I don't have the key yet. So now maybe I have to go into the puzzle to get the key. So the key is probably in here. It's not the key chat. It's the bird. Get the bird figure. Got to plug the bird in somewhere. Probably still staying here somewhere. This is making me go back and forth. It could be. There's a bird cage. right up and down and where am I trying to go what's my goal here what's my goal just keep up where am I trying to get to I guess it's it's a labyrinth I got to find my way all the way it'll just keep on extending till I get there Oh my God, look at that key. Fancy key. It's a fancy key. That's the key we probably needed to go back to the other side, right? Key for the box. Let's go, there it is. There it is. Now we can solve the room, chat. That was the final piece for the puzzle in the room. Let's do it. Okay. We're back in the room. So we got our four pieces and we got to find our puzzle area. 
Where's our puzzle area? Uh oh. Where's our puzzle area, chat? Down below me? Are these like independent puzzles? So I have to solve them on their own? There doesn't seem to be any puzzle area here. This isn't a puzzle area. This is the elevator mechanism. Unless I have to use the elevator mechanism now. Maybe I do. Okay, it's the first time we actually had to use the elevator mechanism. So that's got a hexagon. That's got four plugs. That's a two plug. That's just a flat circle. That's a single plug. That might be it. So maybe maybe this goes here? Maybe, or maybe not. Do I have a two plug? I don't have a two plug. Not yet. That's a hexagon, isn't it? Damn it. Never had to do anything with this before. But I definitely can zoom into it. The hexagon thing doesn't fit on there. I can't zoom into the top. I can zoom into this. Just try all four pieces. Maybe I have to manipulate the pieces. I would have thought it was this one, but it doesn't want to go. This one has... Do I have to manipulate these pieces before I use them? Like that would normally go... This thing would normally go here. Maybe I just put it in right away. No. Because I need the other piece that looks like this. This is weird. I've never... Okay. We've never had to manipulate this thing before. I can zoom in on the bottom to this. I don't know why it's letting me do that. That fits there? That doesn't seem to make sense, though. That was a two-plug, not a four-plug. Okay. Key? That's a keyhole. Okay, that's got a blue pointy on it. This has a blue pointy on it. So this is a dial, right? Good God. What am I supposed to try? I have to complete the circle. Is this Aurora? This is Aurora. This is her DNA capsule. So are we resurrecting Aurora? I wonder if there's more than one ending. I wonder if there's more than one ending. She's gonna wake up and kill us. This is gonna go in her chesticles. This is gonna go in her testicle. No, she doesn't have testicle. Sorry. Got carried away. This is gonna go here. No? Come on. It has to. Doesn't that have hexagon shape? It does. That definitely goes here. Come on. That goes there. You know it does. Not yet, though, I guess. That has to go there. What on earth? I have to do the brain first? I can't go to the brain. There's no, this? It can't be this, it has to be this. So something else first then, before I do that? In her back. I have to zoom in. Roar's gonna kill us. At least the key doesn't morph into other key shapes. We had that earlier. 
we had that one earlier, but it was they didn't make it too tough. So, like uh, earlier this afternoon. Oh my God! It's it's a fembot. Oh, and the mask goes on. kills us and now we die we get trapped yeah and she takes over the world this is our reward told you you should don't wake up the robots aurora to be continued what game complete aurora to be continued you mean to be continued well so to be continued is in there's going to be a second one, a second game. So they they leave it ambiguous. So we 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 went, we went up all five floors, solved all the boxes to collect fragments, then installed those fragments to unlock Aurora. Now Aurora's alive and she's imprisoned us. Stay tuned for This will delete your prod laws. No. Stay tuned for the second game. That was short-lived. So the reward? I don't know if I like that, chat. I don't know if I like that the reward we get for solving all of the puzzles and doing all the... It was a good game, but I don't know if I like the ending. Obviously, they're going to make a boxes too. But I don't know if I like the fact that our reward for all of our hard work was that we end up a prisoner of Aurora. Basically, we free Aurora and she traps us. We kind of predicted that, though. <laughs> All right, Chad, there we go. Thanks for joining me tonight. Okay, we're now a prisoner of Aurora on the fifth floor of this crazy house. We'll have to wait for the second game. Shockwave suggested this, and it was fun. It was a good time to play a puzzle game instead of an action game. Tomorrow, I'll be back. Um, I'll be back tomorrow. It's left on a cliffhanger, yeah. I'll be back tomorrow. We're going to do um, the remastered versions of uh, Tomb Raider. I've got the Tomb Raider remastered editions, the originals, one, two, and three, nicely cleaned up with uh, uh, better graphics, lighting, controls, modern controls, not tank controls. They put the modern in. But they also, because they were scared people were going to be upset that it changes the style of the game, they also left the option. So you can play this with tank controls or you can play it with the with the new controls. I want to try with it. I want to try the whole new deal. So we'll start Tomb Raider 1 tomorrow at noon and uh, have some fun with that. Have a great day everybody. Take care. Thanks for joining me. Have a good sleep. Good night Salem's. Thanks for hanging out. Uh Dr. Claus already gone to bed and anyone who's here who made it through anybody on the vods or on YouTube cuz it will get uploaded. Have a great rest of your night. I'll see you tomorrow at 12 noon. I stream every day 12 noon EST, 8 p.m. EST. Uh, pretty much every day. And uh, I'll be back tomorrow for the Tomb Raider. Oh, you can't see that. For the uh, Tomb Raider remastered games. We'll start those tomorrow. Take care, everybody. Give the channel a follow if you're new. I'll see you tomorrow. Ciao for now. Bye-bye.